We have the great honour to be here with Peter Purvis. Some of you might remember from Doctor Who, some of you might remember him from Crufts, some of you might remember him from uh, Blue Peter. First of all, an absolute joy to meet you, sir. Good to see you. You've, uh, you've definitely been around a long time, you've been, in the, been on the screens for so long, you've been one of my idols since I was a young man. Oh, thank uh, you. An absolute yeah. pleasure to meet you, sir, really seriously it is. Yeah, well, I, I started my first professional play in 1957. And what was that called? It was called uh, The Rainmaker. Yeah. I can't remember who wrote it. It's quite a good play, actually. Uh -huh. And I played uh, a sheriff. And uh, I think he was about 50. And I, think I was 17 at the time. Were you, were you acting before you went on Blue Peter? Oh, long before, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, well, Doctor Who was before Blue Peter. And yeah. I did a year in that. And I'd been an actor, as I say, since 1957. I joined uh, Doctor Who in 1965. So I, was, I had quite a 10-year you know, career as an actor. Yes. And then became a television presenter. So... What's your favourite part of your career? It's hard to say, really. I, I guess it has to be the time on Blue Peter because I mean I travelled around the world, went to a huge number of different countries, and it wasn't just a short visit. You know, we'd go for three weeks and film and serious filming, and it was it, it was wonderful. Um, I don't remember a lot of the studio things, but I mean I did something like I think it was 873 programs really? of Blue Peach and I, I mean television's been my life you know I, I think I've appeared in something like two and a half thousand television shows so it's quite quite a, a lot. How did you feel about working on Doctor Who because you're, you're very early on in Doctor Who's history how, well, did it, how did it feel working in those very early days? It was it was just a job uh, but because I'd been in Weekly Rep which you know is a theatre company where we did a different play every week so every Monday you've got a new play starting you start rehearsing again on the Tuesday for the next one which opens the following Monday and it's you know it's a, it's a bit of a treadmill well Doctor Who was a bit like that because we rehearsed from Monday till Thursday and went into the studio on the Friday and recorded it and that was it and you did it as a, a virtually as live uh, so it was it was hard work but it was it was a it was you know it was what television work was in those days oh, yeah. virtually most things until that time really until about 1963 most things on television were done live anyway all yeah. drama was um, and uh, Doctor Who was done as live and then most of the television that I did for the next 20 years I suppose was live television the Blue, Pe Blue Peter was live uh, the series that I did from Manchester, Stopwatch, sports programme, that was live. We did a thing called We're Going Places, which was a children's holiday programme, that was live. I did Kickstart, we did that as live, but actually it only took us a weekend to do a whole, se whole series. Yeah. Um, which then, you know, we did a commentary on them uh, later and dubbed it over, but essentially we did a whole series in a weekend. But uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's mostly live television. Crofts has been live for years, you know. And I've been presenting that for 38 years. Yeah. And you've got a very large pack of wolves, I believe. They're not, not big enough to be wolves, but they, they are a very nice pack of dogs. I've got wirehead dachshunds, uh -huh. standard wirehead dachshunds. I've got four of those. It's a little family group. We've got the, the, the mother and the sire and two of their puppies. They had seven, yeah. and we kept two of them. So, But they're, they're getting on a bit now. I mean, the, the dam is, uh, she's 10. The size is nine and the puppies are now eight, so shouldn't really call them puppies anymore, should I? Uh, are you still working on Doctor Who, on the audios? I've just finished a big finish, uh, one of the new big finish things which are called shortcuts. Yeah. Um, quite entertaining, quite fun to do. And I've just finished, uh, about five weeks ago I think it was, I did uh, uh, a new full cast play for Big Finish in the Companion Chronicles, no it's not the Companion Chronicles, it's the early adventures yeah. for Big Finish with Maureen O'Brien oh, and so that's lovely and yeah I mean they, they keep us busy and I know there are other things in the pipeline, writers keep saying oh I'm writing one for you, It'll, you know, maybe sometime next year will be, and so I mean we'll, we'll see how it goes. So what's your next thing we're going to see you in? Uh, on television, well, the last thing you would have seen me in would have been a very cough in the spit with Harry Hill at Children in Need yeah. uh, last week. Um, next thing is probably going to be Crufts. I, I haven't got any other telly lined up, so we'll, we'll have to wait and see. Excellent. Well, I look forward to seeing you. It's been a pleasure talking it, to you. It's been an absolute joy speaking to you, sir. Thank Cheers. you very, very much. Thanks. Cheers.